that's a C. Char, do you have a question? Char. <laughs> oh, later na lang. Okay, ngayon na? Okay, may follow up ako from that, no? Um, Siyempre, nag-enjoy ka na sa acting, but sino yung you look forward to work with? Siguro my dream people to work with, in terms of acting people. Ako ang hirap po. Ate Kat? Kat. Ate Kat, Ate Sara. Madami po, anyone. I think I think those two so far. Because I grew up watching Got to Believe. I grew up watching Ate Sara. So siguro Miss Jody. Sila po, be careful with my heart. I grew up watching all of that. So sila po. What about sa Mayo naman? Sa Mayo? Hmm. I think literally anyone, but let's say, let's say my best friend Kylie Chari I've never Kylie. worked I've never worked with him in terms of acting yet. See that in, see that in did. I want to see oh but we've worked together already. What name? See Kyle Nanopo. See see Kyle Nanopo. In terms of acting for Telaga, like I wanna see how he works because I we work together dancing, singing. Um, siya po nag-a-adjust sa akin pag dancing. So ngayon po, gusto ko, ako yung mag-a-adjust sa akin. Like what kind of project kaya ito? Siguro mga kapatid po, ganun. Mm -hmm. Na heavy drama lang po. Ganun. Mm -hmm. Something like that. Okay. Any more questions? Follow up. Oh, follow up. Great, ma'am. Ano, are you open sa pagkakaroon ng love to Um, Opo. I'm, I'm really open to anything that comes my way. Obviously, there's a lot of discussion with that. On, whether it will work or not, but oh, I've been I've been in the industry just yoloing, yoloing whatever comes to me. So I'm very open to doing that. Yeah. Okay, Carlos. The follow-up question, na si ni yung inspiration mo or ino iniidolo mo sa uh, sa pag-acting. Sa pag-acting si Ate Catherine po talaga. I've seen every teleserye of hers, every movie of hers. And the way she portrays her character in each, as an Eva talaga, and that's the goal. I'm trying to be different in each, and hindi yung, I, cause in every role that I played, I've always heard, ay nakikita mo si AC, or or like, oh she relates to AC, parang she, same siya kay AC, and I want to do something that's very different from me, and that's what I see in other cast when she does when she does each different character. Some part ka na ano, dahil dancer ka nga, and. Ano yung naging struggle mo sa pag sa pagkahap sa acting naman? I think being in touch with my feelings because in, in terms of letting it out as in words and with facial expressions and all that. Kasi nasanay po, nasanay po ako na with dance I can release how I feel through movement and that's what I'm good at. I'm really bad at talking. I'm really bad at my words. I'm really bad at writing. Like I'm, I, I just love to release through movement. Uh, so, siguro that's what I had a hard time with, well, trying to connect my feelings with my words and release it for people to feel it in that way. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, Paul. Any upcoming international TV show after we go? Uh, still auditioning. We're always auditioning for just doing that type of thing, but let's see for me. Yes. You have a question? From for Coco, actually. Hello. Um, hi, AC. I've always been a fan as a dancer myself. So, um, uh, gusto ko lang matanong, like... <laughs> See, AC Bonifacio, you're not only local, you've already been international na yan, and I'm very proud of you. Um, what's your dream collaboration in the Hollywood industry in terms of dancing? Hollywood industry in terms of dance? Oh my gosh. Siguro ngayon po, can I say, like, sila bad ali? But that's, that's, is that Hollywood? Could be international. International, like, sila bad ali po, Kiel Tutin, um, Kyle Hanagami, they're choreographers of Blackpink, Lisa, obviously, um, madami po. Dang. Sige na po, sila, sila po. Hopefully, sila po. Oh, so, and bilang nasa topic na rin tayo ng SWF, um, do you think you're open to be, like, kung magkaroon man ng Filipino version ng Speedwoman Fighter, um, 
do you think ba you could be a judge there or gusto mo maging contestant? Gusto ko sumali. Gusto ko sumali kung ganun. I, I, I love judging. I don't love, I don't love judging, but I love watching, I love watching dancers and seeing how their process is. But I also love being a contestant. Then po ako start I was a competitive dancer. And the love and the feel of being in a competition is completely different. And my number one passion will always be dance. And in any way that I can show people that, I will. So if I could be a contestant, I would love. Um, what's your message sa mga tao na gusto rin maging tulad ni AC Bonifacio? Um, siguro, I, I say this a lot. I say literally everywhere. But the, the phrase, don't give up, is so important, especially when you're in that moment where you really need to tell yourself to not give up. I used to think of it as just some cliche that everyone says. And then nung nasa moment na po talaga ako, that's when I had to push myself and repeat it in my head multiple times and all my friends were telling me it also. But literally just don't give up. You're gonna go through the, your hardest moments and you're gonna think that this is it, ganito na lang. And you just have to push yourself. I've gone through the worst um, and until now. Um, and I'm just still pushing myself to get there. I'm sorry, last na, um, backtrack tayo kay Badali because that interested me a lot. Um, what do you like the most about her? And how did she affect you in terms of dancing? I love her control, her swag, the way she, how intricate she is with her movements. Because her movements could be hitting such random beats, but she's still there in the pocket. Um, and you can tell, like, just the way she dances, but her facial expressions, everything works all together. Because there are people who that the that choreo could look over-exaggerated on other people, but for her, it looks Perfect. It's just the way she executes it. Thank you, AC. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, Ashley. My follow-up question. Napanong na to kay Jella. Sabi are you more of a follower or leader in terms of dance? More on follower daw siya. What about you? Follower or both? Follower sa pag sa sayaw. Kasi may ganon. They can do choreography. They can they just follow, but they cannot come up with their own choreography. What about you? Uh -oh. I'm well. Freestyling and choreo is very different. Ako po, I'm not very strong in terms of freestyling, but I can make choreo. Oh. I love to make choreo. I can freestyle on my own. I don't like people watching me, but um, I love learning people's choreo and I love making my own choreo. But oh. in terms of freestyle, the best friend ko na po yun. Kini yan na po yun. Ah, kini yan. So from strong po siya dun. Okay, thank you. You have a question, Anna. Yes. Hi AC, Anna for TV Patrol. AC, recently, sorry, I don't know if you just answered. Recently, you went through a you know, first debut mo sa stage, no? How was that like? Na, you were a good dancer, alam naman namin yun. You've tried acting before, but how was your stage different? And how do you think it will help you further your career? Being a dancer, actor, and singer. Um, I think the main thing that was very different from what I usually do is the fact that you know, one take for me that whole two hours. There are other musicals where people come in and they go out, they can have some water, they can breathe. So people were on stage doing all performances and then we act again and then we do performances again. That's the most frightening for me when I'm on that stage and that's the biggest difference also. Um, the biggest thing I've learned, siguro, is that the stamina is what's going to help me with future projects also that um, that I get, but I, everything kind of just, everything works all together. At the end of the day, theater is still an art, dance is still an art, singing, acting, so it'll all work together at some point. AC, you mentioned, thank you, you mentioned that uh, you're auditioning, you like competition, so I'm sure this was a new challenge for you, yung theater. So how fulfilled are you? Na natapos mo siya, yung got good reviews naman. How fulfilled are you na, oi, nagawa ko to, it's something new. I can add to my resume, my CV. I feel, I feel so, so good about this. Not just for me, but also my whole cast. We've been such a big team working together for it. So I don't want to take all the credit that, oh, I feel so yeah. achieved. We all feel so achieved. We were only able to do it because each and every one of us put in the work for it. But um, it's been a dream of mine to do theater, actually. I did theater when I was back in grade six to school in Canada. So it's been something I've always 
been in awe of, but I just didn't think I would be doing it. I thought I'd just be in the audience watching it, so now that I'm on stage and actually doing it and making other people happy, um, that's always the goal, whether that be singing, dancing, or acting. I said this before, I just want to be on stage performing, and that was the goal with this. I feel super, super good about it. AC, last question and I'll follow up. Last time you mentioned the bana, different same expression for acting. For with dance, does it did it also help for acting? Because even when you dance, you have an expression in the face to communicate it to the other people. Did it also help you? Does, does it help you? Oh, well, from dance, obviously there's facial expressions, um, but I'm used to doing that with the music, mm. right? I, I connect my facial expressions to the music, not to how. I feel and try to get the other person to, to also feel that way. But um, one big thing that dance has helped me with, and it's helped in singing, dancing, and acting, and even hosting, is that I'm very comfortable with my movement. I'm very comfortable with my body. No, the TV patrol ball, the yeah. star patrol ball. Uh, the main thing that everyone was saying, Sila Miss B was like, you really like just move. You just move with your body. You're not stiff. My hands just come out when I'm hosting. It goes out with every word. So it's really nice that that's helped throughout everything. Thank you, AC. Thank you, Thank you so much. Thanks, Anna. Next, Anna Pingol. Hi, hello, Ma. Hello, Ma. Hi, Ma. Hi, Ma. Hi, Ma. Hi, Ma. Okay. Um, AC, nice pa you pa cute la. Of all your hair colors, which is your favorite? My red. First time, it's color talaga. Most of my hair colors are just brown, black. Or yes. siguro konting highlights lang po. Pero first time ko po talaga mag full color. Ah. Apo, my red. I love the red. Tsaka hindi po siya naka-bleach. So it's not dead. Yes! Uh, so yun, paano mo inaalagaan yung hair mo na parating <laughs> so, kakaiba? <laughs> um, I, I just maintain it po. I maintain it every few weeks. Uh, I my hairstylist at the tin also helps me, but I love it. I love it makes me feel so much better. Also, it makes me feel like me, so I keep it with me. Just curious, lang. Um, may pabalikan ka pa ba sa Canada or na i approve mo na silang lahat na dala mo na dito sa Pilipinas? Even though my whole family is over there, my mom. It's just me and my mom over here. Po. My brother is doing school in Canada. All of my cousins, my titas, my lola po is there. So. I, I always go back to Canada every year. Uh, at least once a year. Yes, maybe. Maybe. Holidays, uh, mm -hmm. yun, yun so far. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. My questions, Papa. I have a follow up question. Ayan, hi, Arlette. Oh, follow up lang. Kasi, so, since na rinig namin kanina, we've been doing singing, acting, theater, dance, and then hosting. Diba, nagkakaroon ka din ng mga hosting project. Ano ba ba yung goal ng isang AC Bonifacio? Ano ba ba yung gusto niyang abutin or go in in your career? I want to... Oh, there's so many things I want to do. I want to choreograph around the world. I want to teach classes. There's iba yung joy ko when I see other kids learning my piece and then enjoying it and putting their 100% all in the piece. Um, I started from that also learning from Matt Stefanina, going to LA, learning from Kyle Hanagami, learning from my friends, Katsan Jose, Bailey Sop, Chong Lu, Silapo. It's just, it's so cool to watch and it's one thing that I want to do, just teach around the world. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Nika. I think we're good. Yeah. Ayan, meeting natin ano yung mga abangan na sa Dreamscape Baby. Ayan, may clue na. Hello. <laughs> Like from Lyric and Beat and another project very soon. No, very soon. Dreamscape Baby lang. That's so safe. <laughs> We're gonna announce it. Uh -oh. Yes, from Lyric and Beat. Yes, exactly. Aabawa namin, of course, promote Spelling Bee. Yes, We have a little secret coming up very soon. Wow. Na po. And of course, as of natin to, every Sunday, you can check out all my social media at AC Bonifacio for anything else. Thank, Thank you, you so much, Inisina. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, uh -oh, they're very excited to have their own exclusive interview, of course, Thank with you. you. Thank, Thank you, guys. Everyone. You can have photo and interview her. Thank you. Thank you